right, guys. Reconnect to your spirit is the fifth category of healthy habits that can help you manage anxiety and depression. Today, I'm going to briefly touch on five of, of those healthy habits that can help you reconnect to your spirit. Number one, keep a gratitude journal. It notice finding things to be grateful for takes you away from worries and uncertainty. It shifts your focus to those bits of joy. And noticing those bits of joy throughout the day provides the quiet that helps you connect to your spirit. It can be as simple as going to the store and finding they've restocked your favorite trail mix. Spirit. So many, it has many definitions. I'm going to give you two of them. One from Oxford Dictionary. Spirit is that non-physical part of yourself, your character and emotions, your soul. Um, another di different di dictionary di definition is spirit is what gives you the strength and determination to get through the difficult times and hang on to your beliefs and way of life. Okay. Number two, volunteer. When you volunteer, it connects you to a cause and connects you to other people that are connected to that cause. Number three, spend time in nature. Spending time in nature not only nourishes your senses, it connects you to living things, spiritual energy, life itself, plants, animals. It's amazing. Number four, pray. I'm not a religious person, but I do recognize that there's a spiritual energy to the universe that's more powerful than I. And when you pray throughout the day, it can be very quick. You can pray for acceptance, for clarity, for a way to find your way to thinking about solution. And the number five is yoga. And that's too complicated to quickly go into, but there are many types of yoga and it's amazing. I am going to put some links to research articles and some more information in the description as well as a link to my memoir information guide, Intact, Untangle the Web of Bipolar Depression, Addiction and Trauma. Aloha.